Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday to me today. I'm 11. Yay! This is my harmonica. Say hello, Herbie. Hello. I'll show you how to practice it. So, you go like, oh, that's the wrong way one. She's gonna kill me. Yay! The yes or no game. Na 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 So they would be good to turning it oh, it's around and blue and green. I'm Mr. Tumble. Hello, just a wee track. So I've got Percy Piglets, Harry Bones, Cold and Caterpillars. Transpoles are quite good actually, they're sensory stuff so they can help you. So, what else is there? I can use other stress ball. Yeah, that would be fun. I can't do juggling with those because they're hard and I don't need them anyway. I used to keep Ugh, they smell of paint. Oh, terrible. Terrible.
This is a wee squeezy pair, so while we're here, let's do a birthday story. Back in a second. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Mum and Sam annual 2008. This is a wee birthday surprise to me since we can. Trouble and squeak. One morning Sam was carrying something covered in a blue cloth. What have you got there? He asked. This is the most daringest mouse in Pomp de Pan, they said Norman. He can run up a ladder, dive through the air and land in a tube of cheese bread. Meet the great Squeakando! Mandy sighed. He's squeaky, the school mouse, she said. Our teacher said Norman could look after him for the holidays. Norman and Mandy took Squeaky to Norman's house. They unrolled lots of rolls of toilet paper and taped the cardboard tubes together. They had made a maze for Squeaky. Norman put a piece of cheese at one end. Now the great Squeakander will find his way through the maze of mystery, he said. But Squeaky's cage was empty. Oh no, said Norman. He's escaped. Where is he? Later, Sam showed Sarah and James his latest invention. It's a grabber, he told them. The arms get longer so it can grab things that are too high to reach. Wow, said James. Back at the shop, Dillis was having a cup of tea when Squeaky peeped out of the biscuit tin. He was nibbling her bis he was nibbling one of her biscuits. Ah! said Dillis. Upstairs, Norman and Mandy heard a doy. Ah! said Dill said Dillis. Upstairs, Norman and Mandy heard a noise outside. They looked out of the window and saw Dillis with a brush. She was sweeping Squeaky out into the street. Get out, you little pest, she said. Mandy and Norman ran downstairs. That's not a pest, ma'am, said Norman. A Squeaky ran off down the street. He's the school pet. I'm looking after him. Oh, said Dillis. Norman looked everywhere for Squeaky, but he couldn't find them. He made posters with Squeaky's pictures on them and took them and took one to the fire station. His tail's bent. His ears stick out, Norman told Sam. I have to find him. While Norman was at the fire station, his teacher rang Dillis. She asked how Squeaky was getting on. Oh, he's fine, said Dillis. Norman's are drawing pictures of him, pinning them all, all over town. He is. Squeaky, meanwhile, went to Bella's cafe. He grabbed the cheese. Bella was about to put on Trevor's pizza. Ay, 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 said Bella. A giant at after. He's stealing my cheese. That's no rat. It's the great Squeakando, said Trevor. His posters all are, are all over time. Trevor tried to catch Squeaky, but he ran away. Rosa leapt at him and chased him around the cafe. Yes, Lip, said Rosa. Eek, said Squeaky. Just then, Norman and Mandy arrived. Squeaky, said Norman. Grab him! But Squeaky was too fast for them. He ran straight up the chimney and so did Rosa. Squeak, squeaked Squeaky. Meow, howled Rosa. Oh no, they're stuck up the chimney, said Trevor. I'll call Fireman Sam, said Mandy. When Sam arrived with Elvis and Station Officer Stealing Jupiter, he put his new grabber up the chimney and gently grabbed Rosa. Meow, said Rosa. I've got her, said Sam. When Rosa was out of the chimney, Squeaky ran down and Norman grabbed him. That's the, the great escaping Squeakando, said Norman. I'm taking you home. When Norman got to the shop, Dillis handed the phone to him. It handed the phone to him. It was his teacher again. Yes, miss, said Norman. 
Squeaky's fine. We've been playing er uh, Squeak, said Squeaky suddenly. That's right, hide and squeak, smiled Norman. Norman's colouring fun, so you can help me do this. Colour in this picture of me and Willie. Do it carefully, because I want you to look dead handsome, and so does Willie. If you're a good job, you can write your name on the line. Draw over, then colour in your picture of the flea bag. Sorry, Dusty. So you can draw those pictures if you like. So contact me. So that's the end. So let's talk for an hour. So okay. end of the bay. End to the base. End to the bay. M M M M M to the base. End to the base. End to the base. Bye. This is the best time ever. Goodbye. I'll I'll I'll, 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 I'll,